What's up everyone, this is Big Chips Gaming and welcome back to 7 Aces Dive version 1.0, the gone gold version as it just ticks over to daytime. We uh, transferred everything from the burnt for forest, basically like three and a half kilometers away and brought it, the majority of all of it back here. I couldn't take everything with me, but the things that I left behind were just meh, just meh, just not really worth much, not worth taking. But on our travels, I'll just show you before I take it away. I went to the drop on the, yeah, when, when we ended the video, I went straight up there and I went all the way home, cut across through this uh, little town, straight through to home. And then we grabbed the airdrop and this is what we got out of it. We got a Ranger hat, bartering plus four. I might have to keep that in my bicycle when I go and see the trader. Cause that'd be, or I could just leave it at the trader's house. I could just leave it, leave it with Trader Wrecked and then switch it over when I'm over there. Fair enough, switch out. And then in this book pile we got Scrapping for Fun. Oh my god, finally we can make a wrench. Where were you? Like two videos ago. Uh, we can make Bone Knife Quality 3. We are going to make a workbench right now. Six minutes on that. And it's, and it's done within our inventory. Pipe Machine Gun. Tier 2. I can make a tier 3, so that is pointless now. Throw that away. <laughs> and we'll... Yeah, we'll... Uh, actually, I'll keep hold of it. I'll keep hold of it. We're making the workbench, so I don't want to, like, disrupt the time on it. Six minutes is a long time when it's been done in your inventory. I can't make anything. I can't scrap anything whilst that's in the queue. Is that worth anything? Nah, not really, I'll just scrap it. And the resources we will throw back in there. Take the ammo back. <laughs> throw the ammo in there. Divide that up just a, t just a smidge. Oh yeah, we figured out that in the previous video we could make iron tools. So where's our forge line? I might only be able to make a pickaxe. I don't need to make a shovel. We've got a tier one shovel. And we'll, I know, I know it needs leather. Most definitely needs leather. Let's check it out. Uh, iron pickaxe. Uh, oh, just got enough iron. Wood, leather, duct tape. Wood, got leather, duct tape. And we'll get that on the craft. It's gonna take another three minutes. Because we do want to start mining eventually, pretty soon. We'll get that on the go soon. But I must admit, the um, the nodes, I've said it, I think it was tier, uh, day, tier one. <laughs> I think it was day one or day two when I realized that there are a lot more nodes scattered around. Before, uh, before the update, for, this is just from my understanding, I might be wrong. You never really got nodes inside of cities. They would never really spawn in the blueprint of a POI. And obviously the, the boundary of a POI say is is this, this line. That's how far this POI goes over. And none of them would really spawn there. But look, we've got a little iron node right inside of it. A couple of nodes outside of it. Obviously the, there's loads more nodes outside of the POIs. But I mean, look, it's, it's ludicrous just how many ores there is. Look at this area. Jeez. That is crazy. Oh yeah, we still need to go do that safe eventually. <laughs> oh yeah, that's it. I was going to make lockpicks. I do need me some lockpicks. How do I do? Tools. Is it in tools? Oh, is it only something I could do in the workbench? Lock. Lock. Lockpicks. Yeah, I can only do it in the workbench. That's fine. That's whatever. Got three minutes left on that. Let's go and see if we can get any jobs from... Trade erect. I don't really have anything to sell to him just now. Oh, that's it. It's, it's horde night tonight, Johnny boy. It's horde night tonight, and you've not built a base. You have not built a base. They can get in here. Actually, I had the idea. Bear with me on this. I was, I was stuck between making a base at my house or over this POI this big one over here which I believe it's the bear den 
Yes. Yes, it is. It is the bear den. So maybe not that one. There are two zombie bears in this POI. And we are not in the, f in, in the position to be taking them on. What about here? I could do it at this, at this place. At the motel. Happy sleep motel. I've never done this POI before. It's a tier three. It's a big boy. I need, I need time to clear it. That's the only issue. Is it going to be a really big project to do this? Obviously, I have to take out the stairs. Take out the stairs on that side. I would make this. Maybe build something on the roof. And it looks like it's using four blocks. So no, no, more, no more floating bollocks. Oh, get wrecked. Oh, difficult. Difficult choice. What if I nerd pole? <laughs> what if I nerd pole up here? Let's have a look. We'll just we'll just have a little check. Are there zombies up here? Yes, there is. Okay, what I might do, I might just clear the roof. That might be a good thing to do. And we've got two skill points to spend. That is brilliant. I love it. Obviously, going from the 28 alphas mod, just going from that mod to this one. Uh, to the actual base game seven days is a breeze not just leveling up a lot quicker it just feels so good <laughs> all right boomstick um i did want to put some points into what's it called lock picking uh, i've already got one in there uh what's lock picking do again there it is that's it workstations so yeah the cement mixer chem station crucible all of this is lock picking or advanced engineering. You can go dibble dabble with either either. Um, because it's the Horde Knight, I think I might. Oh, I kind of want to go more into clubs. Oh yeah, we can make a baseball bat now. Let's go level three into Pummel Pete. We are going to make a baseball bat. We'll make it a, a bit later. Alright, so there is danger up on this POI. And we missed. Aim just a little bit too short there. And we got him. Anyone else? Because this would be a good place to do a horde, I reckon. I will harvest you because you give me oh, bones. Bones mostly. Bones are very important. You need bones to make glue. You need glue to make duct tape. And you need duct tape to keep living. Oh, for God's sake. I need a better bow, honestly. Oh, I could just get better at aiming. There's always that. <laughs> right, harvest you. I do like that it's a long walk. It's, it's straight. I do like that. Okay, and this is a way in onto the roof. So if I take out this ladder, they will no longer path up here. Oh, I'm still, still not, still not got the, uh, what's it called, pickaxe yet. Still not got it. It's still ticking down. Is it going to be done? Nah, we'll probably be broken into this by then. And we now have done that. That's good. We've done it just in time, just before that ticked down. Otherwise, I'd have had to have swapped over straight away. Which is not, I'm not complaining. Not complaining in the slightest. So we need to break these open. Break these away. Get, <coughs> get rid of them. Sorry, coffin. You should stop vaping, Johnny boy. And, sure, free stuff. Primitive bow, quality four. Oh, big hitters. Out of mining, mining tools. Mining tools do 10% more block damage. Oh, nice. Uh, and armored up. Light armors, quality two. That's fine. That's good. Right, let's jump up. So now, realistically, the zombies cannot can no longer path up here. Heavy armor's quality too sweet, and medium armor. I'll take the eggs. Yes, I want eggs. Bacon and eggs is life at the moment. So what I could do is should I just build it from the road? I think I think that might be a good shout. Build it to down there nice open plain area 
that might be a thing I could do. Uh, but I am limited on resources. It's the only problem. So I need to be careful with that. Do you know what? I'm not going to build it here. I changed my mind. I'm not building it here. It's too much. It's too. That is too many resources. To, resources to make something that can get up to me and upgrade it to woods, cobblestone. It's just going to take too long. Where's my bike? So what we're going to do? We're going to go home. <laughs> we're going to go home. We just wasted like two hours on absolutely nothing. But you got to be careful with these things. We're about to go into a horde that I have no experience in the i mean don't get me wrong i've done plenty of horde nights but this is the first time doing it in version 1.0 it's going to be daunting and scary so i th i feel like realistically i just need to take this these ladders the, the, these stairs out that's how it seems anyway i do have some stone on me if i get rid of this zombies can no longer get up and i could fight them on the ledge of where the giant hole is uh, on the level that I live on. I think that should be okay. I am worried that they'll try and tunnel, make their own stairway through here. So what we're going to do is that we're going to break this. Because I'm worried that they'll break this. Then break that block, break that block, break that block. And we get and get up. That, that's a worry. So I think the best way to tackle that is to take out this bottom row it's not gonna look very nice it's gonna look very ugly <laughs> but I think it'll be better best for us in the long run right but we also need to check to see if there's any other ways that they can get up I don't think there is theoretically they can no longer stand on any of that so when they inevitably do come in here if they do rage mode or whatever they'll beat onto this but once it's broken, they can't stand on anything. At least that's what I hope anyway. But we are going to put some ladders here. I didn't need to go all the way from the bottom step all the way to the top step. I didn't need to, but it's a... Ugh. I've noticed this as well, that the character struggles a lot more to grab the ladder. Although it's not, it's not happening now. Oh, I don't know, it's maybe just me. Probably. Oh, great. And now... Now the web has gone to shit. Oh, I did upgrade this lot as well. But I did it in a previous video before I started it. Right, so we're up here now. So, I think my fighting area should be here. Possibly. Maybe do it to go down to the main road. Yeah. I think that might be the good idea. And I could take that out so they don't have anything to stand on when they fall all right let's uh copy shape put that down all right i would like it to be centered that's something yeah this is the center centered spot so we'll put that there that's fine i do need to repair all of this oh, what am i doing whilst we're whilst we're doing this stuff Really, we should be, we should be upgrading. We should be crafting. We should be doing something else. Oh my God! And now I can't. Now there's no easy way to get in. <laughs> Whatever game. There is a baseball bat that needs to be crafted, and crafted it shall be. Oh yeah, I should really upgrade these. Just add a little protection. This is looking to be our only way in and out. Weather's gone to crap, because of course it has. Right, it's 11 o'clock. <laughs> We're running out of time. Challenge craft forge, craft forged iron. Okay. How, how much of that did I craft? Crafting. 100. I'm sure I made 100 ages ago, but sure, we'll take it. And sell items, five of them. Is there anything in the main one? Ooh. Survive for seven real hours. <laughs> That's pretty sweet. How high does that go up to? The next one's 21 hours. F All right, 14 hours. That's that's sick. Blood Moon completed. Oh, so I'll get one when I finish the first Blood Moon. Doing 10 Blood Moons. Fucking nah, ass, a lot of XP. I do like that. I do like that. But the only but the only bad thing about it is <laughs> it's um 
it's an incentive to increase the game stage. The more you level up, the longer you survive, the harder the game gets. Scary. Right, what do we need to make a baseball bat? A baseball bat? Where? Oh, I can make it. I can make it already. Uh, dark leather, wood, yep. Yeah, craft. Definitely need you. I know it's a tier one, but needs and must. Must and needs. All right, so now let's make a fire axe if we can. Track you. I'm just lacking on uh, duct tape. Duct tape, please. Let's get some cloth. Duct tape. How many? How many did I need? One more. Well, we'll make it all of them. All right. While that's on the craft, I'll keep the everything else in my inventory so I can craft it into me pockets. And then let's get to work. So let's um, break this so it's a solid block. All right, it's that done. So let's put this down. I, I may need to go and get some more wood. And then straight up. I, I need a nail gun. That's what I need. How much wood do I have? Not a lot. <laughs> really not a lot. I'm, I'm actually quite nervous. Doing a horde night I've never done before in, in version 1.0. This is gonna be crazy. I just know it is. Are we hungry? Yes, we are. Bacon and eggs. Get that straight into my face. Right, so we've got 700 wood. Not a lot of cobble, I must admit. How much stone do I have? How much clay do I have? All right, we'll just craft cobblestone in our pocket. An extra 100. That's fine. Okay, let's... Uh, Upgrade the floor. Oh, I'm gonna have to take this out. Take this thing out. Because zombies will stand here when they fall, when I beat them off. And then they'll beat onto the wall and get in behind me and kill me. Oh, is my stuff done yet? A swap over. Sweet baseball bat is now finished. Let's swap that over. To, uh, two more slots, please. Yes, thank you. That's in. Nice. And what's the damage difference? Okay, 2.5 more damage on the normal melee and 10.5 damage more on the power attack. So that is bloody banging. We've got that going for us. Right. Fire axe. Need it. Oh, I should have done all this yesterday. <laughs> I should probably, I probably should have come home early. Throw that there. Nice. Workbench placed. Challenge completed. Lovely. Right, let's throw... Let's just keep that shit on me for now. Right. Axe is still a ways away yet. Right, let's upgrade this lot. That is now done. Thank fuck for that. Thank you. <laughs> right, uh, modify. Uh, get some more stone. Sucks. Wish it was wood. And then let's throw it into you. Got another mod slot, lovely. What's the damage difference? Block damage is plus 14.9. But it does use more stamina. Oh, I don't know. I don't know if this if the, is the stone axe better because it has higher attack speed, faster attack speed. Where this is a two-handed. And it's this is eating my stamina. Right, we've got some coffee on the craft. Because we're going to bloody need it. Am I hungry? Just a little bit. I might need to put a point into iron gut. Because stamina regen. Uh, not stamina regen. My food and my both thirst and hunger is shocking. Goes down very quickly. And we've done it. Nice. Oh, apart from that one block. Damn it. <laughs> Alright, it's almost done. It's almost broken. Oh, for God's sake. That's obviously attached to the floor. Ugh. Come on, game. Come on, me. Hurry up. I don't have time. It's nearly five o'clock. <laughs> what am I doing? I should not have gone to the burnt biome. I really shouldn't have. But I had to. Oh, really? The floor is plate. I don't have time for this. I don't have time for it. Just breaking. This is more work than what it actually was meant to turn into. I probably had better chances of actually building a new base at the motel. 
Right, so this is now going to be the main. Main. Oh, I need more frames. Um, what, 30 for now? I need wood. Oh, I need wood badly. Okay, so let's go for. Yeah, let's go for here. Right, and let's um, jump up. I don't think this is going to be a supporting pillar. But we need to be able to get from there. So what we're going to do is we're going to have pole. No. I don't want to use, I don't like using these so much. The really thin ones, because I feel it's kind of cheesing. What about this one? Yeah, that's fine. Right, advanced. Put it there. Yep, yeah, that's fine. Put one more. And then one more to come across. Oh, what am I doing? Copy, copy shape and rotation. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. They added that. That's fucking fantastic, that is. Copy shape and rotation. That is brilliant. Oh, now here comes the thunder. Okay, so... I feel like I'm going to do... It has a harsher, harsher angles. So the zombies might hop and skip. That's the centered one. I don't want the centered one. I want the side one. Advanced. Throw that there. Throw another one there. And another one. Maybe there. Because I, I, I want to get them to stagger. Like struggle. And we'll go... Like this. Obviously, if this is if if I had time to uh, build a base, it would look a lot better than this. <laughs> um, I do kind of need a roof to save myself from the vultures. This is literally like a rudimentary base right now. This is like as box standard as you can get. Oh crap! I fell. <laughs> Right, so I feel I'm fine here. I don't think there's going to be cops. Right, and then let's advanced. I like it like in that plane. Oh, I kind of want some hatches. Maybe something else here. Con construction. Where are the blocks that I not that I went for in the other? Yeah, there it is. Railbutt blazes, whatever they're called. Put you there, and I do want to hatch. I only have five. Uh, okay, okay. So let's make a. What's it called? Hatch. Wood hatch. Craft. I'll throw you down. And I need to spin you around. Like that. So when you drop down. That's not right. Is it? No. Oh yeah, normally I'll go three high. Damn it. <laughs> uh, okay, well. This ain't going to be easy. But we're going to have to just do our best. That's all we can do. It's 7 o'clock. We don't have time. Jump down. Right, I might just do ladders. I don't have time to do like a walkway. So ladders it's going to have to be. Throw this there, like that. Straight up, I only got seven blocks left. Crap, I need wood. I need wood, give me wood. Let's test out a baseball bat. Let's see if it'll come up to scratch in the horde. 
two hits on the weaker zombies. Can't complain with that. Alright, so I need a lot more frames. Let's say 30 again. Frames is something I always need. That's crafting nice and quickly. Alright, that's almost straight up to the top. Oh, for God's sake. Get up. Oh, it is at the top. Okay. <laughs> I didn't think I did. Did think I did. Alright. We need to upgrade this. This is the main support pillar. This needs to be cobblerified. To at least maybe there. But the zombies, they can swing through the bars. So I don't want that to be an issue. I might not have enough cobble. It's it's gone eight o'clock. Ten o'clock is the time when the zombies are gonna come. The horde is coming for me. Can I let's go into minus sixty nine er? Yeah. Level two. I think that's a good 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 shell. Right, let's upgrade you. Oh uh, yeah, because I did this. Is this gonna collapse? Please don't collapse. Please don't collapse. If you collapse, you break my legs. Oh, come on. Please don't collapse. You shouldn't, because you're not that long. Okay, I don't want to test fate in uh, doing that one as well. Okay, so let's jump down. We might only have the time to do maybe two sides. Didn't mean to do that one. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh yeah, and I need to do the top front facing part of the, of the fighting area. So the zombies don't stack on top of each other's heads. So let's go to that. Like this. Cobblify you. Put that into woods. I'm thirsty yet again. That should be fine. That should be fine. Alright, let's uh, try and see if we can get another one going on this side. I might just do two sides. So I can... I don't know. I might be able to throw Molotovs. Oh, that's, that's a good shout. I didn't think of that. Oh, and I've got a good amount as well. Right, we're going to have to just try and make it work. 200 wood left. It's nearly 9 o'clock. We've got like an hour. We've got like an hour. <laughs> oh, why have I chosen to do it this way? I keep doing that to myself. Horde base on the day the horde is coming. Stupid. Oh, I've got 300. Maybe this will be enough. I want this to be nice and strong. Because without this, the zombies will find another path to get to me. Maybe just the one side is important. More important than having both sides. Yeah, that's fine. Can I come around this way now? We might have enough, but I do still need cobblestone for repairs. Yeah, that should be plenty. Okay. Right. Let's get inside. Oh, scary. This is actually... I'm, I'm, I'm puckered. I'm all tense. <laughs> right, okay. So this is a good little standing spot to throw Molotovs. I am worried I'm going to clip that and set myself on fire. Right, that needs to be cobbled as well. So does that one. Okay, so that should be okay now. Uh, don't really have any vulture protection. Let's just upgrade that. Near the area. To where I'm fighting. That should be... That should be that should be good enough. Okay, so let's get our stuff. Oh, okay. Right. Uh, throw what I don't need away. I'll keep the wood on me. That can stay. That can go. That can go in there. So can you. All of you can. So can you. I don't need you anymore because I've got the claw hammer right meds take everything all of this stuff and food yeah we'll take the food I'm very thirsty and this is all the liquid I have Ugh. 
not good. Uh, take the jar of honey, take the vi vitamins, eat the vitamins, so it reduces the chance of getting infected. Gun stuff, we'll take our uh, ammo. Uh, I don't really have anything else to use. I could make a pipe rifle, pipe pistol. Right, how do I make that? Pipe, pipe pistol, track, short iron pipes. Do I have enough short iron pipes? I do. And glue. Nice. Pipe pistol. Craft that. And now that means I can carry the 9mm. That's an extra gun. Alright, tools. I don't think there's anything in here that I need. Trader stuff. That's fine. Food, water, beer. Grandpa's moonshine. It blurs the vision far too harshly. I don't like that. Alright, now the zombies are coming. Repair kits. That should be it. I do have some cobble concrete actually. <laughs> Maybe. Alright, here they come. Oh crap. Oh crap. Right, I'm gonna have to try and bonk a few uh, them off the the roof. No, not the roof, the platform. Oh nice. Just keep playing hot scotch, guys. Every time you jump, you stagger and it adds a chance. For you to get throw that. Thank you. <laughs> Piss off. Uh, another Molotov, please. Throw it right there. Try and burn as much and as much as we can. Soften them up. Oh, this is good. This is good so far. <laughs> We've only just started. It's what we're saying. Don't get cocky. Nice. He burnt nice and quickly. They seem to be all regulars. I don't see any ferals just yet. Lois is just hanging out, chilling. She's got her arm, her arm on the bar, waiting for a punter. Well, not a punter, a uh, throw that. When they're all stacked up like that, it's a real good time to throw. We need to get as many as I can for that instant ignition. Our bike is down there. <laughs> he's just laying there. He's turned that, he's turned that into a hammock. <laughs> right. Any more? Yes. Throw that down. Okay. It's I, I don't know the the because I've turned the in-game music off. It doesn't feel as terrifying. But obviously, when I do editing, I'll turn it on. Nice. If you guys can just keep burning, that'd be brilliant. Okay, so not not too bad. Not too bad at the moment. But again, we are going to move house eventually. This is not going to be our forever home. Oh, because I don't want to be in the pine forest really anymore. Because the, loot, the loot here is atrocious. But don't get me wrong, out of all the biomes, the pine forest in terms of visuals, in terms of how it looks, absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. But... And that's a lot of them there. Nice. Burn, baby burn. Relight my fire. You guys are doing that for me. Oh, sorry, Kev. Joe's getting smacked. I do love it. Oh, and some, and some of them actually die. Okay, don't stand there. <laughs> Piss off, Lois. Piss off, Kev. Oh, Arlene just knocked the nurse zombie over. Making me think, love, are you going to have that? Are you going to take that from her? <laughs> if you guys can just, like, fight amongst yourselves, that'd be fun. That'd be fun to watch if the zombies, like, fought each other. Oh, Janna, uh, get absolutely wrecked. Uh, is that a time for another molly? Yep. Yeah. Burn, baby, a burn. That's actually quite a few. That is fine. You guys, just keep, just keep going into the flames. I'll just chill. Soften you all up. Make you guys look like the burnt zombie. <laughs> how we look? How we looking for damage on the base? Not too bad. Okay. See, I always do this. I always over panic. 
and over worry when when approaching a horde but I kind of don't need to worry so much but it's good practice it's good practice to feel that way have the fear factor like slotted inserted inside you speaking of slotting and inserting my burning shaft is calling your zombies names come on oh party girl she wants the shaft and you shall get the shaft <laughs> I was waiting for her to come up so I could say that. Oh, tier, tier 1 baseball bat. Absolutely banging. If I can hit the shot, that is. I've only got 6 mollies left. I do kind of want to save them. I think in the next hordes, I might uh, turn up the, uh, the amount that show up. Oh, get wrecked. I mean, they're not doing too, man too much damage to the, um, the skipping stone blocks. Which is pretty good. Oh, I shouldn't have counted as a hit. I would have thought that I would have got the the bar before I got that. Burn, bitches! Just watch the XP roll in. Oh, a lot of them fell down. Some of them died. Oh, I love this. I can get. I can hit you guys from here. <laughs> oh, Kev. And burn. Have that. Oh, loot bags. Love it. Hopefully the loot bags have been nerfed to the point where they're actually good now. Oh, get fucked. Oh, zombie ragdoll. Oh, see? Zombie ragdoll. I can't think of anything more satisfying. Ragdoll in games is just fantastic. I love it. I absolutely love it. There was a game, I don't know if you guys remember, it's called Flat Out. Hours wasted on that game. Well, not even wasted. Hours of entertainment on that game. On the, uh, kind of like the Olympics levels, where you'd be in like a banger car, racer car, and you drive down a giant ramp, and then at the end of the ramp, you launch your driver out of the car and see if you can get him caught in like this net, and then it will determine on how high he, he got and it and it, you'll be scored on I mean it's called the high jump for a reason just I, oh, I missed that game that game was so good I think they did two of them oh, I wish they did another I wish they did another I think they did one for the mobile for mobile phone ow dickheads but anyway let's get a molly throw that down burn all these bastards We've got to set ourselves on fire. I probably spoke too soon just then. Get rid of Steven. What's Lois doing over there? Oh, they just spawned in. They're having a they're having a think. Lois, are you a horde zombie or a wandering zombie? Let's let's find out. She is a normal wandering zombie. Fair enough. And the, and the Horde's colours look really good. The Horde colours look good. I think they got rid of the fog. So I remember it used to be really foggy at one point. Also, oh my god, businessman. Go and conduct your business elsewhere. I don't want, I'm not selling anything. No solicitating at my doorstep. Oh, I thought I'd try out the knife. Glad I tried it. Oh, dying in one hit. Oh, okay. See you later, Kev. <laughs> oh, look at that. We have survived the night. Survived one blood moon. Lovely. So now the rest of these zombies are a lot slower. Because none of them are feral. Sort you a Muppets out. Oh, I love it. Oh. <laughs> it's, it's, it's a non-issue. It's like effortless. Absolutely effortless. Is that all of them? That is all of them. Awesome. All right, let's see what we can get. Two armored ups, one foot bites, and a sh can of sham. I'll take. I'll eat it now because I'm a bit hungry. Duct tape, nice. Uh, two summon th farmings, uh, golden rod, a chrysanthemum. Oh, and a grave digger. Pretty sure I've got a grave digger already. 
No, I haven't. Okay, great heist volume one. Do 10% more damage to safes. That is good because there is a safe not far away from here that needs some uh, tender love and careness. Bows, primitive bow, quality five, fantastic. And a single pocket mod. Oh, scavenger gloves. Salvage harvest plus 5%. I'll have to remember that when I want to scrap some cars. Medical journal, primitive bow. I've got a tier three. And last one, honey lands and yucca juice. I'll take it. Is that all of them? It does seem that way. That was all of that was all of the loot. Yeah, they didn't really do much damage in here whatsoever. Did a little bit of damage on the uh, the front line block and this this block slash window area. Shit, I just realised something. <sighs> you guys didn't see anything. I took it off to do a thumbnail and obviously I f forgot about it. And I stored it away by accident. Uh, that's got a mod, that's got a mod, that's got a mod. And that's got MVGs. Do I don't think that, no. Okay, so we're running out of space. Can I, hang on a minute, can I stack that on top of an, another single? No, I can't, okay. I swear I'm getting it. I swear to the old gods and the new. You didn't swear. I am watching Game of Thrones at the moment. <laughs> so be prepared for a lot more references of that. <laughs> but very good, absolutely brilliant. We survived our first Day 7 Blood Moon Horde in the brand new version 1.0. Oh, could have asked for a better Horde. That went absolutely brilliantly. And I do I do strongly agree that the Molotovs helped. I'd say about 90% of all of that. <laughs> so I'm going to need to craft some mollies for the next time, for the next Horde. Um, we may do one more Horde here at this base. And then after, maybe on day 15, we'll look to live somewhere else. I do want to, like, try and find the desert biome um, at, at some point this week. Go there. Maybe even live there for a, for, for a few days. Maybe. I can, I might bring my, my tool crafting stations, my forge, my workbench, my campfire, and uh, materials and stuff that I need. I might bring the majority of that with me to the desert. Uh, the desert is like an, it's a, it is a nice sort of like balance of it being not too difficult, but you still get some decent stuff. Or we could just go straight to the snow. But I have no idea where the snow is. I have an idea roughly where the desert biome is. I think it's in the northwest, I think. I'm going to leave this video here. Thank you very much, guys, for watching. If you liked it, please hit the like button. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to stay up to date for more uploads. And please subscribe. Perhaps the channel out bunches. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Happy gaming.